making money. Whoever comes to you for learning is fine. You just mentor, you move on, but you're still trading on your side, you're making good profits and all that. Then you know that even if whoever comes or not comes, you don't mind. You're just making money still in the market. You're not focusing on a lot of things. Things better. So yeah. So my main point here is focus on yourself. So along the way, you're gonna get hate. Along the way, along your way up, you're gonna get hate. That's why you find out that, for example, Messi, Ronaldo, you get people that those guys are successful, both of them. But you find out that people will talk bad about Ronaldo. People will talk bad about Messi. Basically, what I'm saying, people will always have their own opinion. People will say, yeah, Ronaldo has more goals because he's old or because he's this, because he's this. But he's not better than Messi. Messi is better because he has less games than Ronaldo. Blah, blah, blah. You can see the, all those things. So everyone in life, they will always have opinions of what you do. So that's why you got to go out there, hustle, make money, and then the rest is history. Or else if you focus on hate or focusing on scammers, focusing on, you know, all these things, these things will never end, trust me. That's, that's the world itself. It will never end. It's like trying to stop gangsterism. It's like exposing gangsters on the internet. You'll find that there's this gangster in Cape Town you expose. There's another one in Jobo. Inside Jobo, there's another one in Soweto. Inside Soweto, there's another one there, there, there. So it will never end. They're everywhere. You understand? They're everywhere. So that's that. So focus on yourself, make money. And then while making money, when they judge you, it's fine. As long as you're making money. Because I know for a fact they'll always judge you. Even if you make a small mistake, they'll judge you. Even if you don't do something they want you to do, they will judge you. But why don't you do this? It's like it's, it's like they own your money. Why doesn't why doesn't he do this if he really has money? You know, all those things. So you all you always get judged. So be on your own pace. Always be on your own pace. If you get judged, fine. Everyone gets judged. You know, everyone has their own opinion. That's why you find out that um, you get stalkers. You know, people are checking up on you. What is he doing now? What is this guy doing? Me, I like this guy more than him because him, he does this and this because him, he doesn't do this and this because him, he has this and this. So all those things, you always see them in life. You always see them. So you just need to ignore them or use them as a boost. And someone doubts you that ah this one you're lying you don't have this and this or you don't make you don't really trade it use it as a boost that okay it's fine but don't let it put pressure on you but use it as a boost okay fine and then you just keep trading keep trading keep pushing so yeah guys that's that so that's that focus more on learning focus more on learning uh so yeah so someone emmanuel is saying uh bro do we take the trade from the smallest time for ob yes we take it from the smallest ob that you saw okay i mean time frame smallest time frame on the ob uh can you please look at the past ob the market reached this week and show us there is reason it didn't push which one so you must be specific which pay, which pay didn't work out. So we see it. USDCHF. Yeah, I don't trade that pair, but let's check it. This pay is too busy. That's why I don't trade it. It's too busy. Was it up? Was it down? Where was it? Where was the OB? It's not It's mine. Where was the OB? I'm going to give you access to highlight. Actually, you can highlight or circle. Oh, you, I thought you were saying Euro CHF, Euro USD. So, where was it? 
where was it? Where were you singing OB? So you can find out why it didn't work. Is it this one? Is it this one? Is it that one? Which one is it? Long week on H4. Okay. Going down or up? What are you looking for? This one. This one. Is it this one? This one here. Is that what you see? Okay. The reason for this one didn't work out. It didn't shift away. Still playing around inside there. Didn't shift away. Once it shifts away, then you count as an order block like this one. This one shifted away. That shifting away, guys, is very important. Hey, most traders don't know that once an order block shifts away, it's gonna work out. If it doesn't shift away, it's still playing here. And when it comes back, it's gonna do funny things. Me, I want it to shift away. It must go. You understand? It must go. Let me show you what happens when it doesn't shift away. Look. Look here. Can you see what's happening? It didn't shift away. From here, it didn't go. It didn't shift away. If there was more candlesticks going up, maybe three or four, five, shifting away from this area. This is this is the first. I, I wouldn't say this is the first shift. This is just an order block. But from here, one, I want to see it shifting away. But look what it did, it came back. So me trusting this, zero chances. It didn't shift away, it will fail. That's why it did that. But can you see this one over here? Can you see why this one went through? Do you see why this one gave you profits? This one, it's because it shifted away. Can you see that? Shifted away, let's say it came back, give you those profits, fine. Because it shifted away, you understand? This one is not an order block, yeah. It's not an order block. So take note of that shifting away, okay? So it's the same thing that happened here. Here it's too squashed, it's moving sideways, it's too busy, there's a lot of things happening here. It's not shifting away, it's still inside here. So that's why it failed. So I hope you understand. I'm not sure if it failed or what it did, but yeah. Whatever it did, just know it didn't shift away. And then you started analyzing. It might shift away now inside, but where you saw it, that first order block you saw it from, it must shift away. Or else when it comes back, I it's not gonna respect. It's not gonna respect. Even if it shifts away here. See, there's nothing here that I see. Even this one didn't shift away. Yes. Inside here it's too busy. That's why you see spikes, maybe hitting stop loss whatsoever. Market did not shift away. It was cool. It was cool. It was cool. So now that's how you minimize a loss. Hmm. So yeah. Austin? Yeah. Uh just before you move, can you please go back to uh H4 time frame? Okay. Yeah, uh, just uh Wanna draw on this tree, can I? Yeah. Okay, thank you. So can you please tell me the difference between here and the other one that you showed us in this one? This one. Oh yeah, I see what you see. This one is risky, eh? When it doesn't shift away, this thing is risky. Me, I like hundred percent. Oh. So this one, even though it worked out, but it's risky. Just know that it's risky. It doesn't shift away. May I, may I like it when it shifts?